we, this is the flag of Israel. We took the two triangles, which are here and here. We opened the triangles up, which are here and here. And then we opened them wide, which is here. We took one stripe, put it here. We took the other stripe, put it here. I gave you the Holy Quran and the Holy Bible. Or I gave you the Old Testament and the New Testament. Or I gave you one stone tablet, two stone tablets, which is the Ten Commandments. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring all these components together and I'm going to show you something that's pretty spectacular. I'm going to take the triangle. I'm going to place it here. I'm going to take the other triangle and I'm going to place it there. I'm going to take one book and I'm going to place it here. I'm going to take the other book and I'm going to place it here. I'm going to take one stripe and I'm going to place it here. I'm going to take the other stripe and I'm going to place it here. Now I want you guys to pay attention because these stripes have meaning too. One stripe represents the wailing wall. The other stripe represents the holy wall, which they are one and the same. Remember that, one and the same. So, if you look very closely here, you'll see a pair of eyes with eyebrows, with two locks hanging down the side. And remember what I said to you, one I hope I look good for the camera. One and the same. So I brought you the Holy Quran. And I brought you the Holy Bible. I brought you the Old Testament. I brought you the New Testament. I brought you one stone tablet. I brought you two stone tablets. I brought you the Ten Commandments. I brought you this. I bring you this. This was the first coming. I am the second coming.